When you are watching pornography, you are pleasuring yourself while you are watching another dude f***ing a woman. You are literally conditioning yourself to be aroused and to give yourself an orgasm while you are watching that stuff. Gentlemen, welcome back to another video. This video has an interesting topic. We're going to talk about the cuckold fetish. For those of you that don't really know what a cuckold fetish is, it is essentially a fetish where you get turned on from watching other dudes doing stuff to your lady. Or if you don't have a lady, just watching them do stuff to other ladies. Now, in a lot of cases, um, the dudes doing this seem to be black guys, you know? The cuckolds like to watch the ladies getting pleasured by the British Broadcasting Corporation. Now, I think this is a growing problem. The amount of people that are into the cuckold fetish, it seems to rise rapidly. I've had several people contact me throughout DMs telling me that they thought that watching too much porn gave them the cuckold fetish. That they didn't have this before, but the more porn they watched, the more they started to get into this fetish. And also, if you just go to the Dirty Videos websites and you look up these specific videos, you can see that the amount of views that these videos are getting is just insane, right? And it's still rising, it's rising rapidly. And producers are getting in on the hype as well. You know, if you watch like the producers from Blacked and stuff, they start creating more and more cuckold videos and it's becoming more popular. And I think that pornography, just the act of watching pornography is one of the major contributors to this developing cuckold fetish. Because think about it like this. When you are watching pornography, you are pleasuring yourself while you are watching another dude fucking a woman. You are literally conditioning yourself to be aroused and to give yourself an orgasm while you are watching that stuff. And now, yes, yeah, sure, there are different categories of pornography. Sometimes it's woman on woman, but in most cases when people watch it, it has to do with like at least a dude and a woman. And a lot of people, like most, at least most young people these days, they watch more pornography than they do the actual thing. And so the majority of their sexual experiences is them masturbating while watching a woman getting pleasured by another man. And so over time, you are rewiring your brain to get aroused from that stuff because that's how arousal works, right? Like the more you do arousing stuff while watching something, the more you start to create these neuro patterns. And so I think it makes perfect fucking sense that over the years, if you watch a lot of pornography, you eventually start to develop a preference for watching a woman doing stuff with another man. And for a lot of people, it actually gets to the point where their arousal is so rewired that by the time that they actually end up with a real woman, they've never taught their brain to actually get aroused from doing stuff with the real woman themselves. They've taught their brain to get aroused from watching the woman with another guy. And even for people that, that are in a relationship, you know, and that have been making love to their own girlfriends and wives for a long time, a lot of the times they are starting to rewire their brain where they lose attraction for doing the actual one-on-one -on -one act with their wife and they get to the point where they actually get more aroused from fantasizing about their wives doing things with other men. And <laughs> I think it's needless to say that this is like a negative effect because it's, it's ruining your sex life. In a lot of cases, it probably has some effects on your relationships. It affects you mentally. Uh, it destroys your confidence, etc., etc. All around, it's just... I personally think it is not a good thing. And a lot of people who have contacted me also really think that this is not a good thing at all, right? I'm not trying to kink shame or anything. You know, if you actually have a sexual preference, that's fine. But when it comes to the cuckold fetish, it usually is like a developed fetish that people really don't want to have 
and that is really affecting their lives in a negative way. And so I wanted to create some awareness on this, guys. I just wanted to let you guys know, I think that pornography can really contribute to the development of these preferences. Now, sure, pornography affects different people to different extents. There are probably a lot of people who really aren't into that at all. You know, they just casually watch porn without developing fetishes and without rewiring their brain. And they're like, Rob, what the hell are you talking about? I don't want to see my wife getting railed by a British Broadcasting Corporation. What the fuck is that? And if that's you, then that's great. But there are many, many people who are starting to develop more and more of these cuckold tendencies. The numbers don't lie, guys. Just go to these actual websites, type in these, these terms, look up the videos, and you will see that the views on these videos are just insane. And again, guys, I think, well, to me, it makes some sense. Because when you are watching these dirty videos, you are literally conditioning yourself to become aroused from watching the act happening instead of doing the act yourself. And for those of you guys that already have really developed this fetish and you're worrying about it, you want to get rid of it, I want to tell you guys, don't worry. If you actually quit watching porn, the effects are reversible. If a fetish is a conditioned fetish, which it probably is, then the fetish will go away if you quit watching that stuff. Yes, it will be hard. It will be a long and hard journey, but it will be fucking worth it. So guys, good luck. Don't watch too many dirty videos. If you already do so, then quit watching it all the time. Thank you for watching. Click the like button if you like the video. Click the subscribe button if you like the video so much that you actually want to watch more of my videos. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.